Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. My name's Andrew and today I'm going to check out a new show called Percy Jackson and the Olympians which I'm pretty sure was based on a book or a series of books which I've never read but I have seen the previous two movies that were made and I thought the first one was pretty good. I don't really remember the second one. I don't think I can remember anything that happens in the second one and I'm pretty sure I watched it but it has been a long time since I watched those movies. But anyway guys thanks for watching. If you want to see more give this video a like, comment down below, subscribe if you want and let's get into the first episode. That's me back in second grade. Why was I up there? I saw something. At least, I could have sworn I saw something. Uh, are they called the Pegasus? I'm terrible at remembering the names of things. He's saying there's nothing to worry about. It's all in my imagination. But if it happens again, make sure to tell someone. It happened again. These impossible <laughs> things. Just walking down the middle of the road. So real one minute, and then the next. Okay. Is that what regular people see? It felt good to talk about these things with Grover. You could almost believe they were imaginary. Weird, but <laughs> harmless. Wearing tidy whities Until the day that changed too. Grover was sent to look after him. I think. Remember that from the movie. I think Rob is a satyr, like a half goat person or something. Is that why I named me after him? Because he was a hero? What makes you think he was a hero? Because he kills monsters. What makes you think that she was a monster? <laughs> Got his dick hanging out there. Who's it? Bum. That was weird. You will learn to control yourself. Do you understand me? Me? Do you understand me? He can't help it, Mrs. Dodds. Control himself. What's he talking about? He didn't do anything. He didn't do anything that needs to be controlled. Maybe it's time to do something about it. You could make an appointment to see Mr. Kane. He's really good at talking I was thinking through. more like shoving Nancy in the nearest dumpster. <laughs> okay. Oh, no. No, 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 no. That's a bit too far. There's one thing I know about bullies is that you should never, ever stand up to them. Okay, that's not true. <laughs> Oops. Percy? Oh. And this force push there? Percy pushed me! Now she's gonna cry about it. It was only a matter of time before we found you. Okay. She's a full on demon bird. Okay. Well, she didn't last very long. Is she dead? Give him some room, please. I wouldn't have thought they brought that actress in for just that scene. I don't understand. Didn't anyone just see that? Where's Mrs. Dodds? Percy, there's no one here by that name. All right, class, let's move along. So nobody's seen her. Not even before she turned into a bird. Or did their memory of her just go away after she died? Percy had told me earlier in the day that he wanted to get back at Nancy for all she'd done to oh, us. Dude, he's been a rat. And he isn't being truthful about what happened at the fountain. Grover. Are you saying you saw Mr. Jackson assault Miss Bobo Finn? Yes. <laughs> I thought they were friends. Now he's trying to get him expelled or suspended. I saw what happened at the museum. I didn't touch Nancy. I know you didn't. At least, I know you think you didn't. Do you want to tell me what you think did happen? Oh, this, is this the guy that was played by uh, Pierce Brosnan in the movie? The centaur dude? You are special. So much more so than you know. Just stop. Okay, I don't need... Any more stories about how special I don't realize I am. They aren't helping. That'd be weird to hear all the time. 
Especially when they're so vague about it. So what'd you get kicked out for? Hmm? I said I attacked a kid on a field trip. Okay. All right. But still. <laughs> okay. You seemed happy about that. I have a job. What does it look like I'm doing right now? Losing at imaginary poker. You would think that because you're a child and you don't understand things Where's like... Where's my mom? Why is she with this dude if he doesn't have any money? The dude's dead weight. And terrible to her son. He told me what he thinks happened with Nancy Bobo Fit. I told him I believe my kid. It was a real short call. Well, he did do it. He just didn't put hands on her. Mr. Bruner called me too. He told me about Grover. Do you want to talk about it? That probably hurt worse than being expelled. Having your only friend betray you like that. I don't know how anyone expects me to get any work done. Percy and I are... <laughs> Getting any work done? No, I hate watching the Knicks alone. So do I! But make sure they put the hot peppers on my sandwich. <laughs> Not if you're gonna ask like that. I said please. <laughs> please. Could you have them put the peppers on my sandwich? You got it. Talk at the beach. Okay. Pack your bag, let's go. Yeah, I think I remember his mother dying in the movie. Run away, little hero, before you get hurt. I don't know who that was. It looked like a Grim Reaper. I try to pay attention, and I really try, but then I'm daydreaming. I can't help it. Yeah, it does daydream a lot. It hasn't felt like daydreaming. It's felt more real, maybe. It probably is real. What did she say to you? She? How did you know it was a she? Yeah, how did you know? How did you know about that thing I we saw? We come to this place every year because this is the place I met your father. His dad is Poseidon, isn't it? He wasn't a man at all. He was a god. <laughs> That's going to be weird to hear. You fell in love with God? Like, like, like Jesus? <laughs> not, uh, not that one. And half-bloods are not safe in the world. Once they reach a certain age and they begin to understand what they are, terrible forces are drawn to them, driven to harm them before they can become strong enough to fight back. So that's why she didn't tell him earlier. I just... Why are you telling me Percy, this? I know. We we'll try to wait as long as she could before we started figuring it out. Well, I'm not a baby. I know there's no such thing as monsters. I know there's no such thing as gods. He literally just killed that bird creature. I feel very good about how we're doing so far. Grover! What? Grover, why is there half a goat in your pants? Oh, it's... <laughs> yeah. Oh, boy, she didn't tell you about... Well, she hasn't really told him anything yet. We'll continue this in the car. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, he took that pretty well. I'm Grover. I'm your best friend. And what are you? I'm a satyr. A satyr. And I'm your protector. I thought that's what I was called. If I hadn't gotten you kicked out of school, you'd have never survived the night. I would chasing us now would have found you there okay. easily. Kicking him out of school on purpose? The mist kept her hidden even from us until it was too late. Mist? What's a mist? It's the veil that hides the magical world from the human world. My legs. Okay. Even Dodds' absence. Her absence is being hidden. I don't remember her because of the mist. But it isn't supposed to hide things from me. That never happens. Is that the Minotaur? Once the attacks start, they never let up. Right. He is next. He, he is brutal. He is relentless. He is wearing underpants. <laughs> That's what he noticed. 
the cards were training. Everything has been training for what's still ahead of you. What's ahead of me? I'm actually 24. Hold on, please. 24? He looks younger than Percy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she dies here. At least that's what happened in the movie. We're here. It's the boundary. No monsters can cross it. Percy will be safe on the other side. But will all of us be safe? Well, yeah, she can't go. Keep him safe from anyone or anything that comes for him that wants to do harm, that looks at him the wrong way. Do you understand me? I swear. I don't know if it would be trusting him to protect Percy. Doesn't seem particularly good at it at the moment. Smells you in two directions at once. Maybe I can confuse him. Buy us both a little time to get away. Mom, please don't. Hey. It'll be okay. No. Not for her, I don't think. They spent so much time standing around when they could have been running. <laughs> Is he wearing tidy whities <laughs> He is. <laughs> That's hilarious. Turn to dust. I think that means she's dead. Unless it transported her somewhere else. Oh. Did he get him? Damn it. Who gave him the sword? I wish this wasn't so dark. Hard to see what's going on. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. So when magical creatures die, they turn to dust? But how come his mother turned to dust? She was just a human. Give him some space, please. Maybe because she was killed by a magical creature? We've been expecting you. That's how we end the first episode. Oh, guys, there we have the first episode. Pretty much followed what I remember of the first movie. Percy Jackson and the Lightning Thief, I think it was called. I don't know if the first season of this show is going to be about the Lightning Thief or if it's going to be about something else. So far, it's pretty good. I wish I was a bit more light in the scene when he was fighting the Minotaur, but that's about it. Everything else is pretty good. It was a really good start to the season. Percy's already taken out two monsters that were coming after him, and he's not even trained yet, so he's only going to get better once he gets trained. Which I'm guessing the next episode is going to be a lot of that. Introduction to the rest of the demigods and some training. And him finding out who he is and who his father is. So I'm pretty sure it's Poseidon. Alright guys, that's going to be it for me for this episode. Thanks so much for watching. If you made this fun in the video, give it a like. Comment down below, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.